Hey, good morning everyone. I hope everyone's excited for this day the Lord has blessed us with. Um, in my quiet time, I was reading this psalm and I, I really felt in my spirit that some of you really need to hear this word from the Lord today and to encourage you if you're dealing with some fear and um, just the burdens of life are weighing you down. Um, I think this word will be for you and it comes out of Psalm 55 and starts in verse 5 and it says, Fear and trembling overwhelm me. Maybe that's where you are. And I can't stop shaking. Oh, that I had wings like a dove. Then I would fly away and rest. I would fly far away to the quiet of the wilderness. How quickly I would escape far from the wild storm of hatred. Wow. Maybe you could identify what David is speaking here. Maybe what weighs you down. It's just the burdens of life. Maybe you feel like you just want to desperately escape your life and your circumstances and to just fly away and be at rest, far from everything and everyone. If that's where you are, you're facing some of these feelings, just search the Word of God for answers within the verses of this Spirit-filled psalm. Because in, in Psalm 55, 22, it says, Cast all your cares on the Lord, and He will sustain you. He will never let the righteous fall. My friends, if you want to experience the peace and well-being that Jesus brought to us on Calvary, then you must, you must stop trying to shoulder your burdens alone. And you need to surrender them to the Lord. God wants to lift the weight of our cares and our burdens from us, but He requires our cooperation. We must go to Him and tell Him exactly how we're feeling. And we must ask for His help. He doesn't want us to just dump our cares and burdens on Him. We must surrender them to Him, along with our very selves, daily. He longs for us to say, Lord, I can't handle these things alone. So I'm giving them to you. I'm willing to do the things your way from now on. You know, I love how David ends Psalm 55 with the simple but profound words. He says, I will trust you, Lord. Guys, we are never going to truly commit ourselves and our concerns to the Lord if we don't really trust Him. Either we believe that God has our best interests at heart, or we don't. When we struggle with doubt, if we'll be quick to confess it as sin, and ask the Lord's help to believe, help us to believe Him and trust Him, we will discover how eager He is to answer this kind of plea that we have. Well, guys, again, I just really felt strongly in my spirit that some of you need to hear that. Some of you are dealing with fear and anxiety and need rest. And if that's where you are, I hope this really speaks to you again. I encourage you to meditate on this scripture today and and again, I hope it does encourage your heart and, and lift your spirit. Hope you have an awesome day. And know that I love you guys and I'm praying for you.